and the red of the Arkansas Razorbacks. Arkansas kicks off to Houston. Earl Allen, Anthony Ketchum are back deep, and the ball goes out of the end zone. It'll be brought out to the 20-yard line. The Cougars have had fumbleitis in the Arkansas series over the last few years. Houston goes to the draw. Arkansas reads it well, and Tate is slammed down by Nick. Houston with a wide out to each side on third down and long. Landry in the pocket throwing. It is it picked off. It is intercepted. And brought back by Kevin Wyatt. Wyatt going down the sideline is out of bounds, however. Kendall trainer, a freshman from Fredonia, Kansas. He is certainly within his range. He has plenty of leg into that one, and it is good. A 46-yard field goal by Kendall Trainer puts Arkansas on top with seven minutes and 33 seconds left to play in the first two and a half, three maybe. Gerald Landry at quarterback for Houston. Rolling as the blitz is on, and he is dumped at the line of scrimmage. Donnie Center split to the right side. Cal Cagney looks for him. There he is, and he's behind the defense, and he is pulled down from behind. He is inside the 20. That's the forward hash mark on this drive would be the seven. Here is the handoff for the touchdown to Marshall Foreman. Foreman getting his third touchdown of the year as he barreled by Kenneth Blunston, 91, and banged his way into the end zone, and the Hawks for the Houston Cougars. The option gets nailed from behind. Calvin Williams, 13. Gerald Landry dropping now to look and throw. And he airs it out over the middle. It is intercepted. Picked up at about the 25-yard line by Charles Washington, the right quarterback. It'll be marked to the 29 yard loaded quarterback the rest of the way for the Razorback. Cal Cagney runs the option, makes his cut, and he dives. Up across the 40 to the 41, and that's good for a first down. 11.35 to go in the first half. Cal Cagney now he's got to go for Sheebus. He is wide open, and he can't keep his balance. Sheebus had a sure touchdown. Right Mark Cal Cagney operating the offense, and Cal Cagney on the keeper. He's got to go in for a touchdown. His first running touchdown of the year, 23 yards. Very seldom do you get a quarterback and an option team this cleanly into the open. But the Houston team misread the defense. Cal Cagney to his fullback, and it is Derek Thomas who slams his way. A series of first downs. Bobby Joe Edmonds is now in the ball game for the Arkansas Razorbacks. Cal Cagney to throw. He airs it out. That's Edmonds down there. He's going to go. Touchdown. Houston plays a lot of too deep pass defense, which means if you get three people downfield as receivers, one of them is going to be open. If you can throw the ball with enough speed to keep those two men from getting to the carrier, and this time Edmonds was wide, wide open. Or it's very hard to do if you interfere with the offensive team. Rhodes down as a wide out. They're looking for him, and the ball is dropped at the line of scrimmage. A 51-yard field goal. Davis is holding, and he's got the distance. It is good. Brown right back. side on third down long. Let's see if Cal Cagney will go upstairs. He will stay on the ground. He is out into the open. Could he outrun the defensive back? No. He is finally brought down by Israel Martin. Threw himself. <laughs> to Johnson, and Johnson became the blocker. Here's Cal Cagney looking to throw. Wide open to Shebass. Touchdown. is a great speed merchant, but he also runs his patterns extremely well, and it was the running fake that got the Arkansas secondary to come up. You can see how wide open Shebest is. Coming up. Cougars on the move now. Landry under pressure and is pulled down by Nick Miller. Tate doesn't get it. Defense even in the uh, end zone. Here we go. Third down and goal. 
Landry on a drop. Landry being pursued and still looking. He needs help, and there is Ketchum. Touchdown. Landry, a great job of freelancing. And, and a very loose defense played oh. by... Houston recovers that fumble with six seconds left to play in the first half. Ooh, is that going to be far enough? It hit the, the bar and goes over. <laughs> you got to know something's going well for you. Right? Across Houston, eight yards. They're at their own 12. Landry play action being rushed and puts them put down back of the three-yard line. Second down, 19 coming up for Houston. Landry throwing and the ball deflected and almost intercepted. Ooh, it was Rodney, the receiver. Impossible to catch the pass. Uh-oh, Bobby Joe Edmonds was back to receive the punt, but he doesn't have to worry about that as flags go down there. Everything broke down on that one. Uh, off to a bad start in the third quarter. And going in is Ross for the touchdown. James Rouse, his sixth touchdown run of the year. behind the line of scrimmage by Gerald Jones, number 76. The uh, Cougars down 20 to nothing and started to engineer the offense. Now he throws to the near side to catch him and he's intercepted and picked off. It is brought back by Bob Basil, the linebacker. Basil is out of bounds on the seven-yard line. I'm surprised, but his running has been sensational. Third down and goal for Cal Cagney. And Cal Cagney, that's going to be a kick walk for Rouse. Touchdown. They counter back to the opposite side again, and Rouse goes in for the touchdown. He goes into a slot right. Landry rolls the other way, flipping back to Tate, and Tate is thrown at the 19. The Cougars have done something today for the first time in four years against Arkansas. Score a touchdown. Landry throwing, and it is caught, and that's Johnson on a see you later play. Kevin Johnson, the senior from Houston. Tate is in now, Stankus is in. Landry pulled out from behind as Ricky Williams, a strong linebacker, and Bob Basil. Landry drops the football, and I believe Arkansas, it is going to be... I think it's an incomplete pass. That's what he ruled, but uh, boy, I don't know. Oh, boy. The arm's going to be going forward. Landry lays it up in the air for Hilton. He's wide open. Touchdown. Pilsen came in motion, and Landry just floated the ball. His ends, put to the left side. Cal Cagney, Rouse, Rouse. Running strong and gets the first down and plenty to spare with a lot of second effort. And then Arkansas, 42 yard line of Houston. Cal Cagney goes to the run, stays with Thomas. Thomas down to the 30. Very tough. Houston is Robert Myers and he boots it downfield to Bobby Joe Edmonds. 11 to 11. Edmonds on the 43. Look at him go. Edmonds to the 24. Marching on Houston once again. Rouse up the middle. Touchdown. Seven-yard touchdown run by James. The Cougars. Hood and Tater now the running back. A little play action. A flip and a fumble. Arkansas recovers on the 15. Boom. 6.25 to go in the game. And they go back the other way on the counter, and that's Joe Johnson, and Johnson just keeps right on Kevin. It looked like the play was over, and Johnson just wouldn't quit. Let's watch it again. You can see the little misdirection, a little counter step there. He started up inside, then broke it to the outside where it opened up, and then when you're trapped, lower that shoulder, get the leg drive, Overpower the defense, put the ball in the end zone for the score. Landry has some time, now it's gone. He breaks out of the trap, though, and is being pursued from behind by Eric Wooded, the linebacker. He will not do it, and the clock runs out, and this game is over. And the Arkansas Razorbacks 
really unload their offense today to beat Houston by a score of 57 to 27.